Suzanne lives on Waiheke Island, where the beaches are golden and the sun shines bright. And just like all the other families in her community, Suzanne's home's water is supplied by a water tank. But last summer, she was one of the hundreds that were hit with a severe water shortage. What little was left in her tank didn't last very long, and she faced the sobering reality of having no water for weeks. It's not just Suzanne either. She is one of the hundreds of thousands of New Zealanders that rely on water tanks for their fresh water supply, and one of the millions globally. As ever more frequent droughts threaten natural water sources like wells and aquifers, entire communities are shifting to water tanks as their means of natural water. But they have no real means of knowing how long this water will last for. Right now, Suzanne's way of checking how full her tank is is by <laughs> grabbing a ladder and peering into the top. Understandably, she doesn't do this all too often. And if her water tank's running low, her only way to get more water is by a local phone call to her local water supplier, John. And in the heat of summer, John can't handle hundreds of refill requests at once, which might mean Suzanne will be a victim of being on the weeks or even months long wait list. In so many water shortages, like the one faced on Waiheke Island, People don't know what is best to do because they don't have the knowledge to inform them. But what if Suzanne had a way of knowing exactly how much water she had and how to use what's best of it? What if John knew how much water she had, how much water the entire island had, and could use that to predict shortages months in advance? We could keep families like Suzanne's from running dry ever again. So we're building a tool to do just that. So meet Sentinel, a little solar-powered device that monitors your water tank for you. You just put it on top of your water tank, and now you can see how much water you're using, how much it's costing you, and be alerted of leaks or other anomalies. But on a single isolated tank like Suzanne's, we found that we can't actually do that much more with this knowledge. But if she had a way of sharing this knowledge to John, he could have transparency over a tank and automate her refill process. If everyone on Waiheke Island knew and shared their water level, he could predict demand, he could optimise delivery routes, it could completely change how water is delivered on the island altogether. From this we learnt that knowing how much water Suzanne has helps Suzanne, but sharing this knowledge, that helps everyone. So how do we do this? Well, it all starts with Sentinel's little device on your tank. A sensor measures the height of the water, and this data is then sent via the cellular network to the cloud, where this data, just a few meaningless ones and zeros, is then compared to the dimensions of your water tank, where it is then turned into information about your water level at that moment in time. This information is great because with enough of it, we can create knowledge about Susan's water tank, knowledge that forms the basis of the alerts and analytics that keep her up to date, knowledge that can then be shared to her water supplier, John, and as more and more homes on Waiheke get Sentinel, he can use this to keep on top of refills and predict potential shortages. To do this, we use big data gathered from our water tanks, and this is then used with our machine learning models to predict events such as shortages, where big data just means the more people that share their water level, the more accurate our predictions and the more insight we can give to the people that use this water daily. This isn't just a story between John and Suzanne either, because with this knowledge, we can create entirely new conversations with the water regulators, the policy planners, civil defence farmers, the list goes on. Because with Sentinel, we can create foresight and insight to help all the stakeholders in this human water cycle to act before disaster strikes. Our ambition with Sentinel is to create shared knowledge and make it accessible to everyone. Water is undoubtedly one of the most valuable resources we have, and the pressure isn't only being felt on Waiheke Island. But if we can help all the Suzannes out there talk to all the Johns and make this sharing of knowledge the norm, then maybe together we can keep your taps and Suzannes running for years to come. So the next time you see a water tank, you'll know that it holds knowledge worth sharing. Thank you.